Hey folks, Marty up north. Hope everybody's doing well. Today is uh, March 7th. So I just want to do three quick videos. This is the first of three quick videos um, introducing three pieces of new gear that I'm uh, that I've purchased that I'll be using in 2020. So as many of you know, I'm not a big gear head, but I do occasionally replace some gear. So the first gear that uh, this video is all about is the fact that actually uh, they've been, I'm going out tomorrow overnight and people have been talking about the fact that uh, grizzlies have been spotted already in, um, in Canmore and in area. So some of the grizzlies are already coming out of their uh, annual hibernation. So good reminder to uh, start packing again your, uh, your bear spray and uh, carry it with you uh, as we approach uh, real grizzly season, but the new piece of gear I have this year, it's just something uh, fun. Um, I, uh, I I saw that uh, Ben at uh, Hilltop Packs was, you know, he posted on Instagram that he had some uh, packs that he was making where he was uh, printing on uh, any images that you want. So I just thought it'd be uh, fun. I ordered from him uh, one of the one of his large bear bags. This is the large one with uh, with a flat bottom, so this will hold at least uh, six or seven days worth of food. And uh, I just thought it was a really cool thing that it's uh, in, in, it's got my logo on there, the Marty Up North logo, and apparently it's pretty permanent on there. So nice, nice bear bag made of. Uh, Dyneema, so very lightweight, uh, waterproof, and he's got a, an abrasion uh, coating on there. So this paired up with, you know, 50 feet of nice high visibility. This is two millimeter rope. With two millimeter rope, I can toss, uh, you know, you attach a rock on one end, toss it over a branch, then you uh, attach to your bag. I mean, and the way this bag is used, you can store your food in there and, uh, you know, it'll hold its shape better when it's, uh, fully loaded but you got a nice attachment point in there so throw your rope over with a rock uh, attached to the bag hoist up tie up and uh, you're good to go so first new piece of gear that I've purchased so uh, it's expensive for us Canadians you know these are about uh, $35 American as a Canadian with the exchange rate and the uh, transportation costs this comes back to about a $75 item but Ben was very generous very nice as a uh, um, because he knows that I have a good following on my channel, he added a nice, check that out, it's a steak. In case you haven't figured it out, it's a steak bag. So, um, tent pegs or tent steaks. And actually I mentioned steaks, eh, I won't go there. So, uh, there you go, Hilltop Packs. And uh, Ben, you know, uh, he has an affiliate program, so in the links below, uh, I'll put a link to his uh, his company, to his uh, products. And if you're thinking of buying one of these, which I highly uh, recommend, and you just click on the link below, I get a small little commission out of it, which is something I've never really uh, done before. I've not gotten any commissions for any of the work I do, but uh, it's something he offered up, and uh, gladly uh, happy to throw a little bit of advertising his way and mine. So I just went with white with uh, thought it would show off my my logo nicely um, you know great 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 construction folded over a couple of times stitched you can see the tape so this will be very uh, this will be waterproof not that it's really critical for me I, I keep my food rationed in individual portions uh, in Ziploc bags in here but uh, uh, very nice bag. Steak bag. Same same construction, same attention to detail. The only thing is this is a little stiff at this point, but it'll uh, it'll s hopefully soften up a bit with time. 